Call flows, call routing, IVAs, IVRs. There's a lot of terminology to get through when all you're trying to figure out is how to get your callers to the right people, which is kind of important for businesses. We wanna help you with that. That's why in this video, we'll go over IVRs, what they are, how they're beneficial to companies and customers, key features, how to choose the right one for your business. Plus, we'll even show you how to set up a simple call flow in an IVR system. And we'll do it all with science. Cue the Bill Nye the Science Guy music and graphics. Man, how cool was that? Not as cool as IVR systems, I'll tell you that. So what are they? Interactive Voice Response, or IVR, is a phone system feature that helps callers navigate to their desired destination through preset menu options. In non-scientific terms, it's a phone menu system. It's used by companies to route calls efficiently. Customers hear a recorded voice, prompting them to press numbers or say commands, which then guides them to the right phone in the right department. There used to be a time when callers only had the option to press numbers before voice recognition technology. Looking for specific scientific information? Yes, I am. I'm sorry. I can't accept voice prompts. That technology hasn't been invented yet. Yeah, I didn't look much different back then. These days, we've got modern voice-based IVR system. So what's the customer's experience when they call business with IVR today? Let me show you. Because I'm going undercover as a customer for science. The first thing that happens, a customer dials your number and gets connected to the IVR system. Thank you for calling Nextiva. Then they're presented with a series of options. For sales, press one or say sales. For IT, press two or say IT. For Jessica the Science Gal, press 3 or say Jessica the Science Gal. Jessica the Science Gal. The option your caller chooses is recognizing the IVR then routes the call. Sorry. Jessica is busy filming. If you would like Jessica to call you back, please press 1 or say yes. Nice! Now it's offering me a callback option. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. Let's try again. Why is this exciting? IVR systems help businesses balance customer service calls with other business operations. It's easy science. If you have too many unanswered calls, along with too much customer frustration, not to mention a dash of overwhelmed call agents, that combination could lead to a negative perception of your company. Just kidding. These are, these are just different juices. At least I think they are. Mmm, grape. Missed calls mean missed opportunities and potential revenue loss. A well-executed IVR system can enhance a business's image as professional and customer focused. Now, let's put the key features of IVR systems under the microscope. First up, we've got call routing. Fascinating. Under the lens, we see calls being routed to destinations based on rules set forth by the business. Calls are being distributed evenly among agents and some calls are even sent to agents with specific skills related to the call. Next up, incredible voice recognition, a feature of evolved IVRs that can recognize speech and key phrases in order to route the caller to the right department, allowing businesses to provide a more efficient and user-friendly experience to the customer. Hi. I know it's fun watching me look into a microscope, but I wanted to add here that if you're interested in software that not only recognizes speech from your caller, but can have genuine conversations with them as well, find a link to a video all about IVA in the description below. Okay, bye. And ah, uh, custom greetings. They shine so brightly. This feature allows businesses to do things like create welcome messages or mention current promotions. Seems their primary function is creating positive first impressions in the customer service world. Now that you know some of the key features, how do you pick the right IVR system for your business? That's easy, with science. <laughs> that came out way more evil than I intended. But seriously, here are some tips. Look for IVRs with easy setups. You don't wanna have to do a lot of training before you get started. Make sure the system can scale with your business, handling more calls and adding new features when necessary. Check the cost, including initial investments and ongoing fees. Make sure it's within budget. Does the system have a reputation for high quality and reliability? That'll help your business avoid negative impacts on customer experience. And just one more tip before we show you how to set up a call flow in an IVR system, what kind of customer support do they have? You might not think that last one is important until you need it. Now, let's get ready to set up a call flow. Safety first. Here's how easy it is to set up a call flow using Nextiva. In the left menu, select Voice, Call Flow, and Create New. 
you'll be able to add your main business number as well as alternate numbers. From here, you can select what action you'd like. Do you want a welcome message? Maybe inform the caller of your business hours. There are quite a few actions you can add from this menu, from giving callers the ability to reach different departments to selecting Spanish as a language. It's all at your fingertips. So let's review. We've cracked IVR's code, seen its biz magic, and how it dazzles customers. We dished out smart tips, cool features, and had an awesome time playing with an IVR call flow. Science rocks, am I right? Want to learn more? Dive deeper via the blog link in the description. Have another business communications question? Ask in the comments. And as always, like, subscribe, and stay tuned for the next blog powered by Amazing Service. Until next time. We also learned that these mystery chemicals, when combined together, make something delicious. And grape.